Hi, we're Joel and Leah. And welcome back to Vlogmas. Today's video is 21 things British people do, but only when it's Christmas time. Yep, so some people might have read this title wrong, like I did when I yeah. saw this article. How did that you read things it? only British people do at Christmas, and that's not what it is. It's things that only British people do when it's Christmas. Okay, got it. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. it might also be Americans, Canadians, Italians, whatever, you guys might do it as well, but it's things that people only do when it's Christmas. Okay. So the first one that this article on the mirror says that we do when it's Christmas is we light up our homes like the Blackpool illuminations inside and out, and there's always one neighbor who takes it way too far. There is. I've been Googling <laughs> actually like pictures of like bad decorations uh -huh. and also pictures of incredible decorations. Why, for inspo? Just for like, I was thinking we could also do a video on like, te like American versus English decorations. Yeah. Because Americans go so far with their decor. Yeah. Decor. <laughs> and Brits just get it so wrong. Like, it's like literally just these really crappy, like, yeah. little stringy lights. My, my mum's done it. We've yeah. all done we, bad Christmas lights. We all lights. do it. We've all done also, it. Also, isn't the most fun part of Christmas lights going up, driving around where you live and judging people based on their taste? <laughs> Me and my family Honestly, would do it. So funny. We'll, we'll be driving past and be like, oh, look at that house. <laughs> Why on earth have they done that? Yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> it's so good. Oh. So, the second one is like comedy Christmas jumpers. I don't yeah. know if you guys have this. Mm -hmm. I don't know where you're watching from, but there'll be like Christmas jumper day at work and everyone's <laughs> going to wear like the ugliest Christmas jumper yeah. ever. And it's suddenly socially acceptable to wear those jumpers out in public. Yeah. You can be nipping to the shops and it's fine if you're in a Christmas jumper. In fact, like you get more smiles. Everyone's yeah. just like, oh, feeling festive. It's so good. It's in really fact, good. I was watching Zoella's Vlogmas from last year yeah. and it was the last day of Vlogmas on Christmas Eve. Mm -hmm. And she was like, Oh no, I'm really gonna miss like just not thinking about what I'm gonna wear when I wake up because every day until Christmas I've just woken up, grabbed a Christmas jumper and put it on. And I was Aww. like, that's so true. It's just a really easy way to get dressed every morning. Yeah. Chuck a Christmas jumper on. Jeans and a Christmas jumper. Yeah. Maybe a little layer underneath. Yeah. Mm. I've not brought mine today. No. But you guys will see it in vlogs. And also like throwback to Joel and Leah 2015. Yeah. Sitting on that with the brick wall with on our the Christmas sofa, jumpers. On the sofa, yeah, and our yeah. Christmas jumpers. Eating food, of course we were. Throw back. Cheers, Joel. Cheers, cheers to us and cheers to mm. cheers to the Christmas spirit. Mm -hmm. Cheers to having best friends in yeah. each other. In each cheers. other and in Prosecco. And Prosecco is also one of my best friends. <laughs> That's why we're lonely. <laughs> Okay, so the third one is that this is kind of an obvious one. Oh, yeah. That only at Christmas time do we go hunting for the perfect Christmas tree. Something your family do, mm. don't they? They yeah. love, don't you hear, like make an occasion of it? Yeah, well, it's normally me and my dad, and we go and find, we have a live Christmas tree. We have one fake in the hallway, and then we have a live Christmas live. tree. Live, I love it, it's live. <laughs> a real Christmas tree live in one. the conservatory. So we, um, okay. we go hunting for the perfect one. Last year, it took us four trips to find like the perfect tree. What sort of trees do you find along the way? Just like not the right shape? They're too small or there's there's different breeds. So there's a certain breed of tree that we like because it looks good. Um, we normally go for like an eight foot one, I think. And yeah. sometimes they're too small or too big. Um, it's, it just needs to be full, you know, a fat yeah. Christmas tree. And like, was it about a year ago, we partnered with Celebrations and yeah. you did a picture of your tree in the conservatory yeah. with like Celebrations at the bottom. Yeah, it was so nice. Beautiful tree. I love it. But yeah, do you get an artificial one? Yeah, we yeah. do. I'd love to have a real one this year though. I need to convince dad or yeah. mum. I just, someone get a real tree in my family, <laughs> will you guys? Come on, up, have you, up your game. <laughs> have you seen some of the gross ones that are Christmas tree upside down? Someone has tried to make it a trendy oh, no. thing where it goes that shape instead of the classic. So it's a fake one that goes like that. Oh no. Awful. I don't know. Luckily, my mum's no. not heard of that. So, no. <laughs> <laughs> mum. Mum, please, please no. Please no. <laughs> uh, but this year we've got our Christmas tree yeah. up here, guys. Here it is. Um, so we've gone for tall and skinny. Yeah, because we're it's a skinny legend <laughs> tree. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tree for skinny legends. So, uh. The next one is to just cover the said Christmas tree with as many de decorations as it can hold. So I'm talking like stuff you made when mm. you were four years old at school. Yeah. Stuff, just anything, anything. just stuff. Just when you've just gone it. to a garden centre and you found one bauble that you really like. That's just, going like, on there. Put it on the tree. And also like pole position on the tree. Yeah. So like mum will be like, no, I want my Fortnum and Mason like oh, yeah. ball there. And then I'm like, no, but my thing has to go. Yeah. That's front mine. center. I so. always take charge of decorating our Christmas tree, so I'm going home next week to do it. Um, <laughs> They've got Joel home to do yeah, the tree. <laughs> I always do it, but do you know what? My mum always goes in after me and moves stuff. If she, she's like, you've put those baubles too close together. Or she's like, you've put too 
gold baubles next to each other. It has to be like gold and a red, I not think, got or. I yeah, I agree with her. Yeah, really. Yeah. yeah. Well, why would you? Well, you've no, got quite a good eye for. Well, no, I agree as well. When she points it out, I'm like, yeah, why did I do that? But I just love that my mum's like, no, Joel, you do it. You do. It's your Christmas. You do it. <laughs> like, and then I'll do it. Come back in, and she's like moving baubles around. <laughs> she just wants to have you home. Yeah, I know. That's it. That's <laughs> Debbie, like, oh, I'm sneaky, glad I got Joel sneaky home. <laughs> little woman. But do you never decorate your tree? Yeah, I do, but oh, okay. it's not like a, a big deal. No. Usually, I'll get home and it's been done, oh. or like I can. I can chip in on yeah. it but yeah like when we were younger we'd just be like who's gonna put the yeah. what's gonna go on top this year Mom? did you fight with brother john about who could put the thing on the top of the tree no we've never fought oh never <laughs> ever <laughs> no me and my brother don't fight no, <laughs> no. fighting not me Mum's like some people would say i was i'm incorrectly because i'll put a father christmas at the top this year oh and I'm no like, go for it yeah you go, I'm like, you go, go for, for it, it. Come on. You go for it jojo you do what you want yourself, yeah. like she's like yeah i know a lot of people would have a problem with this but Absolutely i'm just doing me not. and i'm like no. you just do you, you do you. Christmas is a time for, for you, you and we, everyone else. And everyone else. <laughs> we have like chocolates hanging on our tree oh. and stuff. So there's always like, oh. so as soon as I go in, so I check good. out the tree and I'm like, yeah. right, what's going? We've got caramel, got this, got dairy milk. Oh. Like, so there will always be yeah. chocolatey things hanging. That's so, as a it's dog owner, so... we can't do that because Oscar would like try and get it. Oh, or yeah. Or jump up at the tree. <laughs> oh my gosh, you can't. You can't. No. You can't just have like a bowl of chocolates lying around. No. Well, we can maybe. do. We will if they're wrapped up, but okay. you can't just have anything laid about because Oscar will eat them. Oh, Oscar! Oscar! <laughs> oh, so leading on, like Oscar, yeah. this is the time of the year that we'll give our pets a Christmas makeover. Okay. So Oscar does have a Christmassy costume. I don't think we've... I think we might have chucked it away, but he did have, like, a Santa coat. Oh, is that his um, present? Yeah, and every year we get him presents. He has his own little stocking, so all of us will buy a present for Oscar, so we'll have okay. five presents. Have you got him anything this year yet? Not this year, right. not so far. You I have will. to get something good, John. I know, the pressure's on. Oscar is high maintenance. Like He expects yeah. a good present. Maybe like Apple earpods? Yeah. Or like, <laughs> some yeah, like wireless some headphones caviar or something. caviar or like something. <laughs> something, like maybe some Gucci drinks. <laughs> <laughs> but also, while you're drinking Prosecco, so the next one is that we sing along to Christmas songs in the car and just find ourselves humming them constantly, like like throughout the day. Oh my gosh, my favourite one in, when you're in the car is mm. driving home for Christmas. Oh, because really? the lyrics go, driving home for Christmas, blah, 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 blah. I take a look at the driver next to me. I like, we just <laughs> love like, looking over and like... Well, what happens when you get the train for Christmas? Oh yeah, I Getting know. Getting the train home for, for Christmas. Christmas. I listen to it still, but I imagine I'm in a car. <laughs> <laughs> they're like, what are on you like doing? A, on a four-seater. Yeah, and they're like, tickets, please. And you're just like, I'm driving home for Christmas. <laughs> I remember one year I caught the train by like the skin of, what is it? Skin, skin of, of my teeth. teeth. Yeah. Sorry, I don't know these quaint. The skin of my teeth and um, everyone clapped because it was Christmas Eve oh, and I would have, if I'd have missed it, that would have been it. That's a Would have been train. stuck in London on oh, my well own done. for Christmas. Yeah. That's what you get when you're working full time yeah. and you can't leave until 8 p.m. on Christmas. Eve Awful. and you run to the station because you're like I have to get home for Christmas you know what Leah if you want you can have Christmas Eve off this year thank you hun working for ourselves <laughs> okay next one's about food um, it's suddenly okay to scoff like whole box of chocolates yeah anything anything you want mm -hmm. you, you just say to yourself Brits say it's Christmas it's Christmas it's Christmas I'm allowed yeah. this anything is fine anything. at Christmas you know you'll just go to your friend like oh I just ate a whole packet of yeah. um bourbon biscuits yeah. and they're like that's well, christmas yeah and you're like oh yeah, shortbread fine. not bourbon i just scoffed a whole packet of shortbread biscuits yeah. they're like yeah well i would expect nothing less it's christmas you should be <laughs> you absolutely should be in fact if you're not eating people are going it's christmas come on come on live a little and you and i have been like hitting the gym so much hitting hitting the gym <laughs> so much lately that like people will have a problem with it if you're still mm. gymming up until yeah. do you know what I mean like if you go to the gym on boxing day oh yeah I did people... last year I think well done yeah I mean I was fat were... last year so I don't know why I went but to but you were gym. doing it what were yeah. you did you have strategy or just cardio no I was just by then I didn't have a, a schedule so I just went treadmill and a few weights and that was and it just, whereas yeah. this time I've got an actual plan so. yeah that's good but yeah but this thing says on the website about scoffing an entire selection box I'd be interested to know Ooh. if this is a British thing or if selection boxes selection. are a global thing selection box. I haven't had a selection box it's, it's so, in so long. long. Like, honestly, they were the best part. The um, Heroes selection box. That's oh, okay. good. That's, That's good. good. That's good. You've got... Um, Galaxy, so you can get Galaxy or selection box. 
it's basically your favorite brand so say if your favorite brand is like reese's they might put together a selection box of like all the best stuff that yeah. they do bite size and then you just eat all yeah. of it and it's just called a selection box but do you guys have that where you're from or is it a uk thing let us know in the comments down below yeah, I'd be so intrigued. I really think it's a UK thing. Yeah, I think it might Because who be. else has got a selection box? Yeah. You're like, oh, I've got you a selection box. And they're like, what's, what's that? that? It's, it's just a, a good box of chocolates. Good present. But if you're enjoying this video, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. We normally post videos thrice, thrice weekly, weekly, but at the moment it's Vlogmas. We're doing a video every, every day, day until Christmas Eve. We might even post on Christmas Day. Yeah, maybe. No, everyone's on their laptops. Yeah. By the evening, like, yeah. no, everyone's People are bored. bored. I get bored Christmas evening. Okay, well, let us know in the comments as well if you want a video yeah, on Christmas, Christmas Day, because we will do it. Could post one in the evening, but then yeah. one of us has got to sit there and upload it. Oh, I could be all scheduled. Oh, it doesn't matter. Could be all scheduled. Yeah, it could be scheduled. Yeah, fine. Yeah. Fine. Fine, 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 figure fine. that out. <laughs> oh, this must be a British thing. What? That everyone, the whole family, gathers around to watch Christmas classics like The Snowman, snowman over and, and over, over again. again. I Ours would snowman. be more like sitting around binge watching Home Alone. Oh yeah, but Home the Snowman Alone. is good. There's so many amazing Christmas films. The Snowman makes me cry because he melts in the end. Spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry if you haven't watched it, guys. That's what happens, and it's really yeah, <laughs> emotional. Really sad. Also, but I don't like the old Christmas films. Like my parents will like. Actually, my dad hates it. My mum likes mm. It's a Wonderful Life, which is an American oh, yeah. film, I think. But my pet, like, loads of people love that. They're like, every time a bell rings, the angel gets its wings. And it's like a black and white movie. I prefer, like, Love Actually. Like, I yeah. love films like that. Like, modern yeah. Christmas rom coms with all the celebs. All, all the, the celebs. celebs. I love watching um, those. But I'll be really keen to know what you guys watch. Again, yeah. there's write a list of everything you need to comment down below because I'm going to say it again. Yeah. Comment down below <laughs> what your favourite Christmas films are. I'd like yeah. some recommendations, please. So number nine is that ice rinks start popping up everywhere. 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 I'm talking indoors, inside shopping yeah. centres, inside stuff that you didn't even know was like... Like, yeah. able to fulfill ice. <laughs> in London, it like they pop up in palaces. Yeah. They pop up like in big outside museums. Yeah. They pop up everywhere. everywhere. We're going ice skating next week, mm. aren't we? On Thursday. Yeah. Cheers to that. Okay, so this one is not true. Okay. <laughs> it says what that it mistletoe say? takes on magical powers and we kiss a lot more. No, it no, doesn't. No, it doesn't. It's such a like americanism that we've tried yeah. to bring over here that just is not happening it doesn't happen Mistletoe. and like i definitely don't get kisses over christmas no apart from from your dog yeah or oh, maybe it does work <laughs> <laughs> the next one is that we put tinsel on absolutely everything oh, I love everything tinsel. you've seen that jumper of mine that's got tinsel yeah. on it yeah, yeah well i've had done. to abandon that this year uh, it's just a bit too itchy i wonder what the youtube party we're going to christmas party at youtube I wonder what their theme is this year because one year it was ugly Christmas jumpers and the last year it was black, black tie. tie here's a picture Joel and Leah black tie this is you can this scroll back on our Instagram year. and find it we'd hit 10,000 or 15,000 15, subscribers Christmas party we were wow. bawling we were yeah. so happy we were buzzing walking around that party and everyone was like, like well done guys and we were like thanks so number 12 yeah. and I've drunk so much of this already that drinking hot wine becomes like the thing to do. Does it just mean mulled wine? Yeah. Yeah, mulled wine mulled everywhere. Wine. Mulled cider's taken off here as well. It really has. In the last few years, yeah. it's like, for people that would usually go out and get a mm -hmm. beer, their option is that they can get mulled cider. Yeah. So it's just like hot apple juice, basically. Yeah. And for wine drinkers, it's mulled wine. It's got like all the fruity stuff yeah. in it. It's like amazing. I made some mulled wine yesterday at home. Oh, really, John? So, yeah. Is this some sort of joke? Sorry. Doing stuff without me? I know. Well, I just needed to use up some bottles of red wine. So poured it in, put some <laughs> sugar in, lemon juice, orange peel, limes. Then I put limes in like in cinnamon there. sticks, bay leaves, cloves, like everything. Oh, everything. And you like mix it together over the yeah. heat. And it's delicious. Did you put like rind, orange, yeah. orange rind? Yeah, yeah. That's cool. It was really nice, but I was shocked at the amount of sugar that goes into it. To so, make it taste good. Yeah. So it's really sugary. Yeah. Oh, I see. That's why it tastes so good, guys. Yeah, and there we go. Pumped full of sugar. Tastes, tastes amazing. amazing. We're not going to do all of these. We're going to end it on this one, guys. The last one that we do is drinking champagne before 10 a.m. on Christmas Day does not even raise no. an eyebrow. In everyday life, if we were sat outside in a cafe at 10 a.m. or 9 a.m. drinking this, people would be like, what, what are they doing? on earth are they doing? But suddenly on Christmas morning, it's socially acceptable. Yeah, in fact, like, people are like, where's your champagne? If you yeah. Want to give it on Christmas morning, you're like... So funny. Oh, champagne for breakfast. I don't even know if we really have champagne anymore. Like, we might have mimosas, or we call... What do we call it? Is that with the orange juice? Yeah, what do we call it? 
We call it Buck's Fears. Buck's Fears, that's it. But Americans call it mimosas. Buck's Fears. We call it Buck's, Buck's Fears. Fears. Buck's Fears. Let's have some Buck's Fears. Fears. Mimosas. Yeah. I, I only learned that word like a year ago. Oh, okay. I got an, it's because I got an email from someone saying, should we get a mimosa? And I was like, what's that? What's that? And then you're like, oh, it's Buck's Fears. <laughs> and I was like, yeah. Yeah. But that's, that's it, guys. It. Those are things that we do only at Christmas, Christmas time. time. Let us know if you have these things uh, where you are from. We will be replying to you guys in the comments. Yeah. Please subscribe to this channel if you're not already mm -hmm. subscribed because we're doing a video every day in December. Go yep. back and watch old videos. Mm -hmm. Stay with us tomorrow. Watch the Definitely. next one. And share want. with a friend. If you think one of your friends who doesn't watch John Lear might enjoy our videos, send them the video. And if you don't think they like John and Lear, then just just go down below, click Airbnb and sign up for Airbnb. Airbnb. You can get £25 off. off. See you next <laughs> See time. See you next time. Bye. 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 I Bye. am feeling festive AF for you. Festive AF. <laughs> festive AF. Festive AF. What As about you? As if it's you? a full word, like not yeah. even AF. You yeah. know the, the true meaning of that. Yeah. Festive AF. Festive AF. <laughs> festive AF. <laughs> it sounds like a radio station. Yeah. Welcome, Welcome to Festive, festive AF. AF. We're <laughs> <laughs> I love that we automatically go to America. Uh, yeah, of course.